My name is Regina treadwell Patel, and I am the proud principal of Conway Middle. Um, I have been serving as principal here for seven years. I also served as an assistant principal here for two years. This marks, I believe, my 22nd year um, in education, and I've done all of my education here as a student in Horry County Schools and also as an educator. My mother um, was the one that got me into education. Um, she retired as an educator in elementary schools for 33 years. And so um, she would have me to come and substitute when I was on my uh, breaks from college and to serve in the classroom as a substitute teacher. My father was um, a transportation manager and he was also a, a deacon in our local church and so he did a lot of serving in the communities. And one of my most uh, memorable moments, like when I came back to Conway Middle, um, one of the parents said, was James Trevor your father? And I said, yes sir. He said, that was a good man. He worked with my father at PYA and he just began all that year. That, that parent was the parent that kind of helped me to build relationships with other people that I didn't know. So I really appreciated that because I didn't know that that legacy was there for me to fulfill. I had no idea that this man, my parent, of a child that I was a principal of was gonna be somebody that could talk about my father and make me feel, make me feel proud about who I am. I am married um, nine years, so um, I was one of those people who got married late in life. I don't have any personal children, but I have a fantastic niece and nephew. He's, a, he's going to Coastal now, and my niece works right here in, in the Conway area. I do a lot of traveling with them and traveling with my husband and, you know, visiting other family members and just enjoying life. And I spend a lot of time in my church community. I'm a worship leader um, there, and so I spend a lot of time in the community doing those things. When I started Coastal, I got to know um, two young ladies from LADA. South Carolina and we formed a singing group called Simple Touch um, and it was one of those little groups where we thought we were going to make it big and we were going to do fantastic things and and then we heard about the gospel brunch at House of Blues so we traveled there and one of the ladies who was over the brunch she picked us up and she said we want y'all to sing and so we began singing at the House of Blues so we were like fantastic in heaven. Those young ladies um, that formerly Simple Touch, that group is now a local community group called True Soul and, and we still stay in touch. We're still really, really close friends. When I think about what I want our Kami Middle School kids to feel and remember from Kami Middle is that they were loved. Like middle school style love because it feels different on a Monday until middle schooler it looks different on a Wednesday till middle schooler, and on Friday you could be their best, best everything, or you could be the worst thing that walked in the door. It's so many different uh, ups and downs and waves that middle school kids go through, but I want them to remember this is the place that you were loved, this is the place where um, you trusted what we said and you created your own future and you took the steps that you wanted to, to, to take, and I want them to remember that it pays to always um, do right, you know, when nobody's looking. I say that a lot. You know, you won't get it all right, but I just want, to remember, want them to remember how much we love them in the middle school and prepare them for what the world has for them.